man, I always thought when I was younger, it's like, you know what, when I have kids, they'll all come from one father. But as you guys know, life takes twists and turns that we're not even prepared for. It's, it's different having like different dads. <laughs> What's up, Perfectly Blended family, and welcome back to another video. I'm Chantel. That's Jasmine. I'm Danny. And guys, this is what it's like when you have kids with a different partner. Before I get into it, guys, make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell. So when we drop a new video, you're alerted. All right, guys, let's get into it. All right guys, so I just dropped Amaya off to her dad's house. It's Friday and she spends every weekend, unless we have something planned, with her dad. And I just wanna share with you guys, cause it's not always like easy for siblings from different like parents, let's say, to see their brother or sister leave. Now in our case, Jasmine is upset because she wants to go to Amaya's dad's house and spend a day or two there with her. But this weekend, Amaya has her friend, her best friend that doesn't go to her school coming over to see her at her dad's house. And I want them to spend some time together because they haven't seen each other in a very long time. Now, Jasmine's upset because she wants to be with Amaya and Amaya's friends. And you kind of know how that goes, little siblings like to tag along. But I want Jasmine to understand that there will always be a next time like she'll have the opportunity to go because Ryan's family is like super dope they're super open to having the other two over there but I want to give Amaya the opportunity to spend some time with her best friend because she hasn't seen her in a really long while so we're going home I'm hoping that Jasmine cheers up I know it's hard for her because her and Amaya are close like all of them are close but I mean this is like reality like this is how it is i often felt this way when i was young and my brother would go to his dad his dad lived so far away and i would get really upset when he left because he was the only other person i knew besides my mom and then my dad wasn't living with us but it was just me my mom and my brother so i know jasmine's feelings like i always wanted to go spend a weekend with my brother and see how it is and i never got the opportunity to although he is seven years older than me but Amaya and Jasmine are really close and I get how she's feeling. So hopefully she'll cheer up. But this is what it's like when you have kids, I guess, from different parents. It's, it does become hard. All right, guys, I'm gonna take Jasmine home, feed her and see if she cheers up. All right, let's go. All right, guys, so I stopped for gas and <laughs> I'm like, pretty much sandwiched in like I can't move look at this one person in front of me one person behind me I guess like I could like inch my way out but the guy in front of me is really close and it looks like the lady behind me is pretty close too especially when I put the car in reverse like she's right there so you know <laughs> no one cares if I get out today they're just pumping gas and I'm just sitting here it's all good uh Jazzy how are you feeling games. she wants to play games with who Maya no. oh you want to go home okay will you feel better if you play your games okay well you can go home and do that you have your homework did you get homework today no yeah, guys, so she's still pretty upset because her sister is gone. But Amaya will be back on Sunday. Jasmine knows this. It's been like this since Jasmine was a baby. So it's really all the kids know is Amaya goes to her dad's on the weekend. But you know what? We can do fun things. Like there's a lot of things we can do at home, right, Jazz? I know. Do you want to make chocolate chip cookies? Will that make you happy? Yeah, let's do that. 
make some chocolate chip cookies. Hopefully we have all the ingredients. We seem to go through a lot of stuff at home, guys. We all eat a lot. All right, is anybody leaving? Nobody's backing out. Where are these two people that own these cars? Guys, <laughs> literally sandwiched in. That's hilarious. All right, guys. I saw that, that guy in front of us um, went inside of there. Oh, he, he went into the gas station? Yeah. All right, so he's in the store, Jasmine says, in the gas shop, whatever. All right, I'm gonna give them a few minutes and see if they come out. All right, guys, we'll check back in. That's the person right there. Oh, where? Going right in? There. Yeah. No, it's not. Yes, it is. All right, all right. All right, guys, we'll be right back. Danny. Danny, we're home. Danny. Jazzy, do you wake him up? Danny. <laughs> Danny, we're home. Danny. Okay, Jazzy. <laughs> Danny, Danny, we're home. <laughs> All right, guys, so we're home. And there's Miss Jasmine. She's still in a little bit of a mood, but she's requesting that not only do we make chocolate chip cookies, but what do you want to do, Jasmine? Okay. All right, guys, look. What do you want to do? I want to put these on. What are these? Nails. Nails. She wants to put these nails on. She got this as a gift from her godmother when she spent the weekend on family day. Or I should say family day weekend. So she wants to do chocolate chip cookies and put on nails. Will that make you happy? What if I say no? I'm gonna <laughs> Stop it. So it will make you very happy if you get to do both. You should be happy anyways. Life is great. Can I do it? Yeah, we can do both. <laughs> all right guys so greg is at work and it's just me and the little ones here so i'm gonna get them something to eat because they just came from school and then we have to pick up daddy later danny's in a mood too he just woke up <laughs> from his nap in the car yeah, but yeah I, I thought you wanted to eat dinner Okay, get your chocolate dip. They usually have a granola bar when they come in and then they have dinner later. So I've learned that I have to pick my battles and just, it's Friday, let them have their granola bar and then maybe we'll have dinner in an hour. Anyways guys, so we're gonna be getting daddy from work a little later. Guess I'll be making chocolate chip cookies with Jasmine and putting nails on. So that's what the evening's gonna look like. All right guys, we'll be right back. A little later. Jasmine. Jasmine, it's okay. Just finish up your homework, okay? All right, guys, so Jasmine is just having a rough day. It seems like she's just finishing up some schoolwork and then she's like free for her whole weekend. But she's having a hard time maintaining her happiness. So in addition to making cookies with her tonight, as I promised her, and putting on her little sticker nails. I told her when we go to pick up daddy, we can go to Bolt Barn to get a treat. So I actually wanted to take Danny here <laughs> to Bolt Barn to get a treat because he did such a good job with his lessons today. He didn't give me any trouble. He just came home, he had a snack, and then we went through his numbers, his shapes, his tracing and coloring and sight words. And he did a really good job today. So I'm like, okay, I'm going to reward positive behavior. He was really good. So I told Jasmine, hey, do you want to go to Bolt Barn to get a treat? And she's like, yeah, I do. But it doesn't seem like it's cheering her up a whole lot. So hopefully once she's in the store and she sees the variety of treats, that'll cheer her up. And then hopefully before the night's over, she'll be in a good mood. All right, guys, <laughs> we'll be right back. All right, guys, so the kids are eating dinner. Danny just ate up all his meatballs, but Jasmine is having a meatball sub, and it looks like she's feeling a little better. Let's take a look. How are you feeling, Jazz? Good. Feel a bit better? Yeah. You ready to go to Bulk Barn? Yeah. Okay, good. Mm -hmm. Danny's just eating a hot dog bun. He had meatballs, but he ate them up, so now he's having the bun. <laughs> just butter on it. <laughs> he loves bread. 
All right, guys, so the kids are done their dinner and they're ready to go to Bulk Barn. Look, Bulk Barn uh, closes in 30 minutes, so we don't have a lot of time. Look, I have a triangle tooth that's pink. Oh my goodness. She has a triangular tooth that's pink. <laughs> All right, <laughs> guys, so let's go to Bulk Barn. All right, guys, so there's lots to choose from. So the kids are just gonna, you know what? We'll just go down aisle to aisle and see what they want. Okay, guys? Okay. Okay, okay Danny, we'll go down each aisle and see what you want. Mm -hmm. Guys, Danny's already like going around the store his own way. <laughs> He's like so excited. I don't think I've ever brought him into Bulk Barn with me. You went with Mimi before? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Those are baking guns. Those for like baking. So this is the popcorn aisle, looks like. So this is caramel popcorn. Danny was just asking for it. What's this? That's green peas. Uh, that's pumpkin seeds. <laughs> that's right. Let's keep going. Look, these are all the cookies. Like animal crackers. Yep. Wait, I, wait. All the yeah, cookies. And the oats. Yeah, this is where my grandma got these. Yeah. Probably from here. You're right. So, Danny, this, this is, is the chip, chip aisle. aisle. Yes, exactly. What's this? It's Cheetos. Yeah, those are, they say it's cheese sticks. It says cheese sticks. They're the puffier ones. <laughs> See anything you want in the chip aisle? No? No. Okay. Okay, let's keep going. <laughs> Does anybody want chocolate? No. No, you guys want the candy, right? <laughs> okay. Yeah. Those are, yeah, those are the Reese's miniature with pieces. Do you want chocolate jazz or candy? I want, I'm having candy. Yeah. Candy? First I just want to see. Oh, Jasmine says she just wants to see. She wants to take a look. Well, you're getting close to the candies. All right, guys, so the aisles have been waiting for. I like this one. Gummy worms. <gasps> Jelly bean eggs. Are we Yeah, look at all the Easter candy. Yeah, look at these. Whoa. Nothing in here. Yeah, that one's empty. Yeah, no one. <laughs> caramel. Yeah, there's caramel squares. All right, guys, this is the last candy aisle, so if you see anything, yeah. let me know. Go right down to the bottom. There's watermelons here. Mm-hmm. There's this. There's also this. So many to choose from. Jelly Rancher. Mm hmm Your favorite? I don't eat those anymore, buddy. <laughs> they work. All right, guys. So we're going back to this aisle where we saw all the Easter candy. They said that they saw something that they'd like in this aisle. What do you want, Jazz? You want juicy gummy teeth? Yeah. Juicy teeth gummy? Yeah. Okay. I'm going to choose from here. Okay, what are you going to get? I will choose... I'm gonna, ch I'll probably choose one of these. You want the sour gummy worms? Yeah. Okay. Looks like the kids found what they want, guys. So we found the candy that we want. Guys, show them what you got. Show them. <laughs> Here you go, Jazz Jazz. Nice. And guys, I've been eating pretty clean. I only cheat on the weekends now. And weekends, yes, starts on Friday for me. So I got these and obviously i'm gonna share them i'm not gonna eat them all all right guys we're gonna head to the cash hey, all right guys so we pay for our treats and now we gotta go get daddy so let's go 20 minutes later all right guys look who's home <laughs> the kids are really excited to have their treats just got in, so we're gonna take our stuff off and enjoy and some then treats. We're gonna make cookies. Yes, we have to make cookies, make cookies with. Yes, I promised Jasmine I'll put on her sticker make, nails wait. and make treats with her. Yes, Danny? Don't right. forget to make Easter cookies because it's almost Easter. Oh, we'll make Easter stuff when Easter we're closer. Is to Easter. A month and a bit. Yeah, Easter's in April, Danny. <laughs> Alright, guys, I'm gonna get settled when you're going out to clean the driveway. I'm just gonna shovel the walkway. Alright. All right, guys, the kids are so excited to have their treats. I said they can go ahead and have them. So, go on. Go on. How much are you going to have? One. You can have two. Okay. 
Let us know how those taste, Jazz. Time to bite, which I love. <laughs> okay. Well, there's a smile on your face now. <laughs> oh, Danny, which one are you choosing? Those two? Okay. Yummy. Mm. Is it good? Okay, nice. Glad you guys are happy. A little longer than a few minutes later. All right, guys, so look what hubby brought me to eat. Mmm. So this looks like the steak naan. I'm not sure if you guys saw that video we did back in the summer. The food video from Naan and Chai. Guys, these naans are scrumptious. Like, Greg surprised me with this. Thanks, babe. So Greg's just up in the shower and Jasmine and Danny are downstairs playing and I'm just enjoying this meal before I bake cookies with them. But I just wanted to talk to you guys just a little bit about Jasmine being upset that her sister is gone. Now, she's, this it's not new behavior. She's been like that before. She'll cry and she'll get upset because of course she wants to play with Amaya all the time. And Ryan's parents are so open to having the kids over, but I don't want to just be sending Danny and Jazz over there like every single weekend. Amaya needs her time and space with that side of the family. Especially like I mentioned earlier, guys, her best friend's going to be coming over on Saturday. So I really just want her to spend time and just, you know, just relax without her little siblings always behind her. But on like the other scale of things, it's, it's different having like different dads, right? And it's kind of nice that Ryan lives close. Like I have to give thanks. Like I'm so grateful that it's just like a 10 minute drive to his house and Amaya is there. But like I said earlier, growing up, my brother had to travel like two hours away on the weekend to see his dad. And I was left by myself. Well, just me and my mom and no one else to play with other than friends I had in the neighborhood. And I often became sad because I wanted to have him around. It was like my comfort. Like you don't even realize it's your comfort until the person or that thing is gone. So Jasmine and Amaya are really close. Like Jasmine keeps up with Amaya and they really enjoy each other's company. But luckily enough for Jasmine, she has Danny and they're two years apart. So Danny and Jasmine do play well together. But I get where Jasmine's coming from when she says she's upset because you know, Amaya's gone and she wants to have fun. You know, she wants to go to Amaya's dad's house and have fun with her, and I get it. But, man, I always thought when I was younger, it's like, you know what, when I have kids, they'll all come from one father. But as you guys know, life takes twists and turns that we're not even prepared for. And I really couldn't plan my future, right? My future is unfolding the way it is for whatever the universe or God has in store for me. And I'm so grateful because my situation with both dads are amazing they're amazing men and I couldn't ask for better fathers for my children and I'm again so blessed that I co-parent so well with Ryan guys because honestly when I think things could be worse such as like Ryan could live far away or he could be like a you know not a great father like all the problems I could have and I don't I just count my blessings guys and I really try to have Jasmine understand the circumstance and the situation and she's pretty understanding but I know her little heart's broken because she wants to go have fun it's just sometimes I feel for my kids right like I want them to stay together but it's being fair to Amaya like Amaya needs her space with her dad and she needs to spend that time with her dad without Jasmine following behind her and it's not that I'm being mean like I don't want Jasmine to think I'm being mean but I'm being totally fair like I love all my kids equally and I just think for us our situation may be different to some other families where you know Amaya has to be shared between the two families and sometimes Jasmine does feel that and I feel bad for her but you know what I'm happy that her spirits are up she's happy that we're gonna make cookies so after I'm done eating this delicious non guys I'm gonna make cookies with them and then I'm gonna put on her sticker nails and then I'm gonna send her to bed and then I'm gonna call that a night. <laughs> Guys, if you have any similar situations where you have kids from different parents, maybe you guys can comment down below. Let's just be a community and help each other out. How do you guys cope with it? Like what are things that you do? Just so that the other siblings don't get too upset when maybe their brother or sister leaves. Like how do you guys cope with it? Or maybe some people don't know how to cope with it or maybe some of you guys have you know, your family all together where the kids all share the same parents. 
But if you want, guys, drop a comment down below. Let me know. All right, guys, I'm going to enjoy this naan. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. There's like steak, onion, cheese. Oh, guys, this is gonna be so good. Mmm. <laughs> guys, amazing. So grateful Greg got me this. All right, guys, I'll be right back. <laughs> All right, guys, so it's now finally time to start baking some chocolate chip cookies with the kids. This doesn't take very long. This pack we've had for a while for the kids to make. So Jasmine's now getting an opportunity to make these. Well, Danny is too. Right, Danny? You're gonna help? Yeah, you are. Okay, so first things first, Jasmine. What do we need? You wanna read the ingredients? Yes. Okay. Where's the first one? It's right there. Step number, oh sorry, that's heat. Right there. Here. Yep. So you will need half a cup of um butter. Butter. So do you Can know? Can I do one? it? Can I do it? Yep. Half a cup. Do you know which one is half a cup? This one. Yeah. So we gotta. I'm gonna help you, okay? And then I'll put it into here. That's right. All right. So we need half a cup of butter. So here's our butter. It's all oily and so it's, been, <laughs> it's been sitting out for a while. Trying to get it to room temperature. Yeah. Okay, Jazz. Where's your little cup? Right here. I'm gonna take this. Do we have enough? Yeah. We're trying. Oh yeah. I think I think it's enough. That is not enough butter. This is not enough butter? Oh, sorry. I thought what you just put in there was all of it. I apologize. I did not see the rest hidden there. No Look at Jasmine smiling. She's <laughs> <laughs> it's making her day. Right, Jazz? It's making my day too. Yeah, and yours too, right? Okay. But your right. day's already made. His day's already made? Well, this is making it extra special. Okay, so then, yes. You're going to put that in there. Okay, cool. Danny, do you want to take it off this oh, knife? Yes. Shake the knife. Shake it in there. <gasps> Yay! Good job. And then Jasmine, do you want to scrape? Okay. Good. There we go. Okay, and then what else do we need, Jazz? What do we have in there so far? Just butter. Just butter. Let's see. So oh, one egg. One egg. Okay. I do it. Okay. I'm gonna crack. Okay, crack an egg. And then Danny's gonna help us pour the chocolate chips in. That should be good. Do you know how to crack it? Good job! <laughs> Mom's reaction. <laughs> it's gonna explode. Good job, that honey bunny. Me. Oh, sorry. There's the yolks in there. That's the yolk. Yeah, that is the yolk. The dunny of the yolk. Here's a clean napkin if you need one, honey. That one's a little. Greasy. Okay, Danny, your turn. We're gonna. Did any like of the like put in the shell? No, you did good. High five. Okay, one of the chocolate. Okay, you're gonna pour all of it in. You get to do all of it. Oh, can I do some? Well, you did the butter. We're gonna give him a turn. Pour all of it in, Danny. Yeah. Oh, very oh. good. <laughs> yay! Yay! <laughs> a little, little bit of a spill. It's all good. That one's not enough. Well, there's some in here. Do you want to pour the... Can yes. Jasmine pour the rest, Amy? Yep, she can. Okay, so Jasmine's going to pour the rest right in there. Yes, Very pour all good. Of it. Wait, guys, let's... We don't have one. <laughs> sure. Get the chocolate. Oh, that's okay. I'm sure it'll be fine without A that little, little bit. Powder. I don't know. Oh, my gosh. That could be the difference right there. You and <laughs> look at, like, this difference thing. Jeez. Well, you can blame it on the, the, the I dust on the counter more if it doesn't turn over. <laughs> okay, we're gonna. I wanna see. You wanna put it in? Get the butter. Okay, get the butter, get the butter. Put it in the cookie chocolate. Okay, Shit. give it a good mix. Start mixing it. I wanna mix too. Okay, so the kids have started mixing. And Danny's doing a really good job. Hold on, Jasmine, let him get a good mix in. Good job, Danny. Use those muscles. Good. Do you want to give Jazzy a turn? Yes. Okay. Jasmine, your turn. Wow, Jazz. Use those muscles. Good job, guys. Very good. All right, so I'm going to do the final mixing. Get it all nice and mixed up. It smells good, doesn't it, guys? Yeah. Oh, Danny, don't put your hair in there, bud. Okay. Then we're going to be eating your hair. Right. You guys should have your, your hair tied back. Yeah, we all should. How about this? 
Yeah, you still have to put your face in there. <laughs> Honestly, guys, I find that the Betty Crocker chocolate chip mixture is like one of the best things to make with the kids. It's so easy, like just butter and that's, one egg that's and that's it. That's and mix, more we roll it up into little balls, put it on a baking pan and, and in the it. oven it goes for like, what, eight to 10 minutes? Yeah, it's so easy. It's really easy, that's why I really like this one for the kids. Okay, who's ready to roll up the balls? Me, 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 me! Okay, so we're, we're all gonna do it together. Yeah, I think that's a great idea. All right, we gotta get the pan and the parchment yes. paper. Can we start? Can yes. We... So the kids are excited to roll the dough. So yeah, pick that up, Jasmine, and that's a good size, and just roll it. Danny, Where do you Danny wanna? Go? Danny's. Danny, we're rolling it. <laughs> oh man, let's right. see what he does. Yeah. Oh, look at Jasmine's ball. That looks nice. Yep. Keep going, Jas. What's Danny got going on? Don't make them too big, okay? I made it in my ball. Well, mommy will space them in on that on the tray. Yep. But yeah, you guys are doing a great job rolling the balls, okay? I'm making them. Small. And you don't want to put them. Yes, you don't want to put them. You want to make. Is this you, Jess? Yeah. Okay, keep doing that. Keep going, Danny. That. So just make a ball, a little ball. Good job, size Jazz. Jazz. Tiny. Jeez, Jazz, look at you go. Yeah, it's it, it, mine. That's Thank good. You. Let's add a little bit more dough to that one. Yes. Here, yes. like this, this much. That much. Okay. Okay. Here, you roll that. Okay, you roll this. Okay. Yeah, Danny, that's how you do it. Good job. Good job, buddy. It's it's fun doing this. Right? Yeah. You like baking? Yeah. I do too. Do you like and baking? Remember we baked the gingerbread man. Yes. I re did you like that? Yeah. Oh. And, I, and you remember I like the sour nose? Yes. It was like the, the Rudolph nose. Rudolph nose. Very sour noses. Yes. And we made the Cinnabons? Yes. Santa's. Santa's Cinnabon. That's right. <laughs> Wait, can I tell you something? This is, I yes. think we also best. did. We also um made. We, we also did um. Th Wait, the houses. The gingerbread houses too. Yes, that's right. <laughs> we did a lot over Christmas, didn't we? What was we? your favorite yeah. baking? Um, this one. <laughs> this one. <laughs> this one's my Actually, favorite. Actually, I like the cinnabon. You like doing the, the cinnamon? This one's my favorite baking. This is your favorite one? Actually, yeah. Rice Krispies. I just like all of them. Yeah. <laughs> I like all of them too. Yeah. I like this one and all of them. Let's okay. see how it's coming here. So we should probably be able to fit about 12. What do we got on there? Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. All right. And so Roll this one, in. you guys are going to keep going? We can do one more. Oh, yeah, well, we're going to put it on that tray. Oh, that looks like a spot. We'll see. Yeah, okay. that looks like it could fit. So all right, we'll it's do not that. terrible. All right, bring the other tray over. Mommy's gonna put this in the oven. Let's follow mommy to the oven. Yes. And we're putting it in for how long? Um, let's go eight minutes and have a look. Oh, maybe we do four, four minutes and, and turn it or five minutes and turn it? Okay, hey Google, set timer for four minutes. Sure, four minutes, starting now. All right. There's so much that we did. Yes. So this one has how many? So this one has 11 balls. Oh my gosh, and there was 13 on the other one? Yes. Because there was 12 and you threw yes. one more. So, so it's we even. have two dozen. Yes. This one's squishy. That's okay, we'll put it in the pot, in the bowl, sorry. So these will be ready, we'll let them cool and then we get to eat them. Okay, Jess? Right. And then, they once we- Nails! Yeah, nails! Oh okay. my goodness. They, they went flat like this. <laughs> oh, they went, what did they do, Teeny? They split like this. <laughs> That's what the cookies did? <laughs> no, no, they're splatted. They're, 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 the, their bottom, their bottom is splat. <laughs> oh. They're not balls anymore? They're, the bottom is splat. <laughs> oh, they're going to turn into a cookie. And then we get to eat them. Yeah. Yay. All right, guys. So the cookies are in the oven, at least the first batch. And the second will be going shortly after that. But so until so. then, we'll be right back. All right guys, so it's now time to take the cookies out. We left the cookies in for about, I'd say 10 minutes. 10 minutes total, yeah. yeah. So we're gonna take it out now. We 
because the thing with these cookies is you look for like the brown around the edges there. I you know you guys can see it. What's up with that cookie? Don't touch. Sparkles in that one. I don't know. That might have been teased. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, they, they, they're gonna get hard, right? So we gotta let them cool. I just! In the meantime, we're gonna put these ones in. We're gonna okay. put them in for five minutes and then turn them and put them in for another five. Okay, Google, set timer for five minutes, please. <laughs> okay, five minutes. And we're starting cool. now. All right, guys, so while we're waiting for the chocolate chip cookies to cool, I promise Jazz, I will put these stick-on nails. Can you guys see that? They're like these little stick-on nails that her godmother got her. So thank you, Gotti. Say thank you to Gotti. Thank you, Gotti. So we're putting them on now. So let's see how to do this. First, you have to let me know how you're feeling now. Good. <laughs> Good? Good? You're not sad anymore? No, I'm not sad. Okay. I don't you know that you're going to see your sister on Sunday, right? Look, this is... Wait, tomorrow? Well, today's Friday, so Saturday, Sunday. And you don't need to get sad like that because you know she's coming it's back, so right? like that, see? But you're happy now yeah. because we did quite a few things tonight. Yes, yes. Right? Pretty, yeah. It's pretty yeah. awesome. All right, guys, so I'm going to put on these sticker nails on her. She's been asking me, so let's just, let's just do it. <laughs> Place pre-glued nail at the base of cuticle and firmly press onto clean nail. Oh, it's easy. Literally, you just press them on. Okay. <laughs> it's easy. She thinks it's easy. Let's go. These are so cute, though. But I know. A little heavy. <laughs> I saw you so heavy. <laughs> this is like the best day ever for Jasmine here. Yeah. If you like push hard on something, don't just pop out. So, is there like a peel and stick of there's some no, or something? There's no peel and stick. Which is kind of awesome. You just take them out the package and stick them on. Oh, they're like ready to go right from yeah. the plastic. Yeah, but the thing is Amaya put hers on and they popped off. Cool. All right, guys. So Jasmine's nails are all done. How do they feel? Look. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> do they feel weird? Yeah. What do they feel like? Just let me see, because it looks like skulls at a glance, but they're like little llamas or something, aren't they? Yeah. It feels like I got um my like nails cut all the way until it's short, and then you have that weird feeling. Oh, like that <laughs> numbish feeling that it's like... Okay, I think I, I have an idea of what she's talking about. Now, when I was her age, I could never imagine putting these on. I wouldn't dare. My dad was not having it. For some of you that don't know. Oh, here's Danny. Just go go right there. That's perfect, buddy. <laughs> yeah. My dad's from <laughs> Trinidad and he didn't like That's anything nice artificial. Dad. So I couldn't paint my nail with nail polish. I couldn't put artificial stick on nails, even though these aren't gonna last. Like they're no, gonna pop right off. Yeah. <laughs> but I could not do that. I'd get in trouble. Like big time licks. But you know what? That taught me differently that I don't want to do that. So that's just it. I don't see that. Yeah, As a parent, just, I, I don't see that. Yeah, so I'm raising my kids differently. She can play with them, and they're gonna fall off, and I'm not gonna get upset with her. So. Yeah, guys, look who's making a mistake in the kitchen now. Daddy forgot to set the timer on the second batch when he turned the cookies around. So I'm just gonna keep an eye out. <laughs> I gotta stay. Way to go. I gotta supervise the cooking. And that's so easy. At least it wasn't a cream cheese brownie error. This was so easy. All you had to do is put them in and set the timer and he forgot. You see guys? You see? We all make you mistakes. You gotta try and put something on. We don't care. <laughs> yes. Jasmine and Danny, are you guys ready to try your cookies? Okay guys, let me see how Jasmine eats. Cause you know when females get their nails done, we like talk with our hands a lot more and just you know, you just use your hands a lot more than you did when you get artificial nails, or even when you get like your nails did, like a nice little manicure. I want to see what Jasmine does now. This is gonna be so cute. All right, guys, let's go. Yeah. All right, guys, pick your cookie. Jasmine, let me see how you're picking your cookie. Oh. <laughs> let me show. Let's see the bottom. Let me see what it looks like. The bottom. The bottom. All right, they look good. Nice yeah. and golden. Okay. Wait, let, you Jack, let Danny pick his. Okay, Danny, your turn. Which one are you gonna pick, buddy? It feels like the same one I hold it. 
Ooh. Okay. okay, let's sit at the table, guys. Let's eat your cookie at the table. Sorry. How is it? Good. Good. Nice. You like it? <laughs> nice. What a treat for you guys. It's Love your nails, special. Jazz. Love your nails. <laughs> okay, they're coming out. I see some golden brown. Oh, okay, good. Daddy says second batch is coming out. Nice. And then we're just going to let them cool. Perfect. Yeah. What a perfect Friday night, eh, babe? Yeah, it was. Like, it started off a little rough because Jasmine was upset because Amaya's gone. Because, you know, if they're close, they have that love-hate relationship. When Amaya leaves, Jasmine balls. But then she got over it. But I'm so proud of our kids. Like, they've come a long way. They're learning so much. And... I just love them all. Like, they're just so fun. I just love them all. I do. Of course you do. <laughs> I do. So I think this was like a perfect Friday night. Minus Amaya's gone, but it's perfect in the sense because I know she's at her dad's house and tomorrow she's going to be spending a few hours with her best friend that she hasn't seen in a long while. So yeah. I'm, I'm happy. I'm happy. You but, guys got to do this. So. Yeah, and they've been wanting to bake. And we'll get more. Amaya always... Oh, they got to come see me at work. Also, the kids, yeah, got to go by and see daddy at work, which is pretty <laughs> awesome. But you know what, guys? Let's say bye to the fam, because these guys are going to get ready for bed. Yep. Bye. Come here. Ugh. Bye. <laughs> bye, guys. <laughs> All right, guys. But before we leave out tonight, make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell. Up there. Because we don't want you to miss a thing. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. We'll see you in the next video. Bye. Bye.